Hello, everyone. How's everybody doing? Um, I wanted to get on here <sighs> because I've been going through a lot. I hope this not too noisy with me moving this thing around. But, man, I don't even know where to start. Um, yes, this is basic because I don't feel good today. Um, I'm feeling more like, like I got a virus or something, some type of flu virus. And I know y'all don't need to hear this, but all last night I was up pooping. <laughs> it felt good to poop too. Don't you get it twisted. It felt good. I had to poop. And today, well, I've been up all night moving back and forth, back and forth, and just feeling weak and tired and just weak and tired. <laughs> I guess that's what you could say, just weak and tired. But um, I went to sleep. I did finally go to sleep last night after getting up about two or three times and woke up just feeling kind of ugh, stomach hurting feeling like I got a headache um just not feeling the greatest and um was supposed to go to therapy but I literally could not. I tell y'all what, my phone just turned off again. This is what I deal with when I'm trying to record from my phone. But then got up the strength to go, you know, to get up to go to therapy and I got up the strength to take a shower, get dressed. And um, this is about the limit of the makeup. I think I had put a little bit of mascara here. Put some eyeshadow on. Put my eyeliner on that part. Got to down here. And linked my head down. And then I had to hurl. So I done went from pooping to hurling. Then my energy went down. And as y'all can tell, this is my bed. All my stuff. Yeah, that's what all of that is. My Bible, my cameras, still trying to record, even though I'm sick. This is my vape pen. Y'all don't need to be looking at that. But anyway, um, cameras and stuff all over my bed just like but as y'all can tell and oh and this is the other side of my my stuff you see this this has been working it out why I'm sick why I have a why I have a uh why I woke up feeling like this or having a virus or whatever it is. I'm going to say it's a virus that just went come and go, come and go. Um, yeah, I just feel crappy. How about that? Okay. So, and I was trying to vlog and do all this stuff this past weekend. And this is the result. This is the result. Me and my bed. And ouch, 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 ouch. Why is this hurting? Now, hold on. I gotta try to. Oh. Ouch. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's a little bit better. Thank you, Jesus. My bed sits up. <clears throat> 
it'll move, guys. So, okay. Raise myself up. Put myself down. And right now I got my feet up. And I'm in a little groove on my bed. So that's why it took me a minute to get up. But anyway, I hope everything's going great with you guys. Um, I did, uh, let's see, what did I do? Mm, I think I shaved my head. Um, I think I cooked some stuff. Or no, my husband cooked some stuff and I just ate, um, I don't know. This weekend went by so quick, I did not get to read the rest of my Bible. I know I got on here and I was in a up, I was like, yeah, yeah, okay, I'm going to start, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, but in all honesty, I just kind of spiraled and went downhill instead of uphill. But these are the type of things that happens when you have lupus. Like, for real, for real, your every day is a mystery. Every single day is a mystery and a new surprise. My face breaking out. Every time I look in this mirror or look in the mirror, I see something else. I could just see my skin changing. I don't want the rash on my face. But I'm going to do like everybody else, wear makeup, right? Right. Um, but, like, you just go through so many different changes. <sighs> One minute you're fine, the next minute you're not. One minute you're up, the next minute you're down. And it could be pain. For me, it could be pain. It could be just... I'm exhausted, extremely exhausted, and I could be done just woke up and still be exhausted. Um, I have a light headache right now, too. I'm going to blame everything on whatever this virus is my body trying to get rid of. I'm going to blame that on the headache on that, but I do get headaches. Um, I'm always cold. This is a blanket. Oh, and I'm I'm <laughs> I'm sitting on top of my. I can't get this up, girl. I'm sitting on top of my um comforter on my bed, but I'm literally covered up with a blanket. And as you can tell, I love blankets and pillows because I'm always cold, and I always need to readjust or get my body adjusted in some type of way so yeah but these are the things that happens when you have all of this and I don't know if y'all know exactly what's going on with me but I'm pretty sure I done said it a thousand and one times <sighs> that's how I feel Exhausted. What's that? What's that? Piece of lint. A piece of lint, y'all. Piece of lint. Probably came from my hat that I have on. <sighs> this is my old raggly, rusty, dusty. And yeah, I put it on all the time. I'm usually like this. Let me see. Oh, I'm usually just like this. I'm usually sitting around with my hat on like this. But when I get on video, I want to do this. Because I don't need y'all seeing all of that. <laughs> well. Oh, I thought I'd just touch y'all off again. I was going to say no. <laughs> but um, for the most part, that's, 
you know, pretty much what it is. I, every day I go through something. I'm trying not to share everything through the camera because I'm always thinking like they don't want to see that. But I just got to be real. I don't even know how to be fake. I really don't. <laughs> I can try to hide stuff. The next thing you know, it's right back there anyway. So I'm just saying. I'm not a fake type of chick. I'm a real type of chick. Okay? And I'm so upset about this. Can somebody tell me how to work my camera? And I've been fiddling with it all day, and I don't have the right connections, I guess, um, to go with it. But I really want to use it to vlog because, my, like I said, my phone be cutting in and out and doing all this other stuff. Then, on the back of the, so with this, I need this port. Let me, what? Here, hold on. I am got y'all. I'm trying to hold y'all when I can just put y'all on my stand. <laughs> so, hold on. We'll do it just like that. Perfect, Bernice. So this, like, it has a card in it at the bottom. I'm going to show y'all because I don't know how to work it. Well, my SD card goes right there, right? That's my SD card. My batteries, I got them on the charger right now. So then I just shut it up like that, right? This is for the stand part. This is the camera part <clears throat> with the lens and all of that. And it's got the on and off button, the record button right here. But what the problem is, is that I do not know how to get it from here onto my computer. So, I then got one of these. A strip. I can stick this part in my computer, but then, and it don't come loose right here at all. It doesn't come loose right there. But the card will fit in this slot, right? So then I put it on my computer. Boop. And guess what? It won't even download it off the card from the camera or off the card onto my computer. So that's annoying. That's how I feel about it. That's very annoying because... I can't get my stuff off my SD card if I don't have a way to do so. But that's one of the things that I've also been going through. And since I'm sitting here, I was trying to figure it out. My head hurt, y'all. I guess I could do... Give y'all a couple of funny videos from Snapchat or something, huh? I could do that. Or I could just simply talk to you and let you know, like, hey, this is what it is. This is what's happening. This is what's going on. And you know I don't feel good because I don't got on no brain, no bracelets. I don't even got on the hoop earring. I don't, no eyelashes. None of that. Because I don't got enough energy. And I don't feel good. And guess what? Around here it's been raining all day. So. What we gonna do y'all. I'm gonna just have to let y'all. Um, script read with me. Script read me. Write with me. Read my Bible with it. Um, 
I do a lot of journaling. This is my journal. Literally. Journal. You can find it on Amazon.com. Say write it down. And then on the back. It say write it down. And then on the bottom. Creator Bernice Abbott. So this is the journal that I created. Oh wait, Charlie's supposed to be. And as y'all can tell, I'm always writing and doing stuff. But this is my scripting journal. So this is what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day or the rest of the night. I'm just gonna sit here and write and look at television. I guess that's one too. But I just wanted to give y'all a reason as to why I stopped the vlog, why I haven't been vlogging, what's going on with me, what happened this weekend, why I didn't re finish reading, um, what was Proverbs, Proverbs, and I think I, I stopped at Proverbs chapter 18, and we were supposed to do it for a month. And in and out, on and off, on and off. And that's kind of what happens with me all day, every day. Anyway, it's like I get busy doing one thing, then I can't focus on it enough, and then I'm doing something else. And then I can't focus on that, and then I'm doing something else. And then I can't focus on that, and then I'm doing something else. And then I can't focus on that, then I'm doing something else. And then I can't focus... They call it fibro fog or lupus fog. I call it ain't nobody got time for that. Okay. That's what I call it. Ain't nobody got time for this. Ain't I, I, I want to get back to being doing the things that I want to do. So I'll be changing some stuff around in my life, period. Changing a lot of different things and letting it. Uh, showing y'all the new person that I am. What's that? Mm. One of them little changes. I don't know why y'all, I can see my lupus so well, and it's annoying. I rebuke it all with the blood of Jesus. But... We're going to try to get consistent. I'm going to try to be a little bit more consistent, a little bit more <sighs> refined, a little bit better. I'm just going to show y'all the real me, the real life, the real stuff I go through. So that's what half of today is. And it's also an explanation as to what happened the weekend for all my subscribers. I love y'all. I told y'all that. I love y'all very much. And if it wasn't for y'all, I probably wouldn't be talking to the camera, okay? <laughs> but I like talking to y'all because y'all literally help me mentally and physically. So thank you for that. And I would like for y'all to comment back and tell me what y'all think. But I haven't had too many, too many comments, but you're welcome to comment and talk to me. That That's not a problem. My name is Bernice. They call me Sure Simply Her because that's my uh, my name that I created for me. And yeah, there's an LLC behind it. So don't try it. You can try it if you want to. No, I'm <laughs> just joking. I ain't got nothing to do but sit here on this bed and talk to y'all. So I'm just like this. But for the most part, oh, God, Jesus, help me, Lord. Mm. Hold on. So right now my head is hurting. My stomach is twisting. And I got this arm up on the back of my head like this. And this arm don't like to raise as much as it should. Oh, 
I'm doing therapy on it, y'all. I do go to therapy. I was supposed to go today, but I couldn't because I was sick. But <clears throat> it's getting better. Better and better and better and better and better. Oh, my tummy hurt. Oh, my tummy hurt. My tummy is hurting. And my head is hurting. Guess what? I also need to take a breathing treatment, so y'all get to watch me do that too, I guess. So, we'll be, I'll do another scripting video, but for right now, y'all gonna have to hang in there, because I gotta hang in there, so y'all gotta hang in there too, right? Jesus. Okay, y'all, so what I didn't tell y'all is that I have a, oh, <clears throat> oh, almost knocked my whole thing over. I have a, uh, Why is the okay? That's that's low enough. That's low enough. But uh, so there's lupus, right? There's chronic fibromyalgia, mm. which I can't even tell you how much that annoys the crap out of me. Um, I have uh, spinal stenosis. Um, it's medication. I'll be it all. Mm. So lupus, fibromyalgia, spinal stenosis. Um, a connective tissue issue, which is a part of the fibromyalgia and the spinal stenosis. Oh, my head is hurting so bad just by bending over like this. Jesus Christ, help me. Um, what else? I think it's just those three. Oh, wow. As far as physical, it's the lupus, the fibromyalgia, the spinal stenosis, and then I have, um... PTSD from when my son was murdered and ADHD from when I was little and was abused. No, <laughs> I hate to say that like that, but for real, oh, it's a part of it. But <clears throat> attention deficit hyperactivity disorder is what they call it. So, like, <laughs> I could be talking about something then totally forget what I was talking about. And that sucks. This is a breathing treatment because, yeah, I think it's COPD, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. But they just want to make sure my lungs stay open so that the lupus don't attack. And that's what this treatment is for. I really can't stand putting this thing in my mouth and, and, and letting it filter all through. But, gotta do what I gotta do, right? I know y'all wanna sit here and hear all of this. So pause, please, and then I'll come back. And I'm back. Woohoo. 
Okay, guys. Oh, Jesus. And why every time I do that, it make me feel jittery? Mm. Drink a little bit of this. Mm, mm, mm. The things you go to, go through, as you get older, after you have literally done the things you want to do in life, that's when all the bodies start breaking down and you, and you feel like hell. And I don't know if I told y'all that or not, but like for real, for real, about 11 years ago, I was a totally different person, um, which I ain't going to repeat this story too much. You can go back and look at other videos if you want, but like in 2000, the last day of 2012, uh-oh, guys, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> trying to get back over here so I can get in the bed. But the last day of 2012, uh, my son was murdered. My only son, my baby, he was actually the baby also. And he was murdered and I got extremely sick. And um, next thing you know, I'm this sick, so. Yeah, that's pretty much what it was. <laughs> One minute, I was fine. And then after all of that stress that came along with it, I literally got sicker and sicker and sicker. Let me put my head up some. And as they say, I guess it was from the um the stress of it all. But yeah. And I was working and I had my own business and I was doing all this stuff. I read a I ran a daycare center. I was up on my feet. I have three daughters. Um they all live out of town. They don't live where I live at, but <clears throat> they're all older. They're grown. And as time went on, after his death, I just got sicker and sicker and sicker. And this is where I'm at currently. So God is good all the time because I'm still here. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Right. And I know that God will work work everything out and everything will, you know, go according to his plan. So I'm literally trying to give of my stuff still, give myself still to people. And if I could bring a smile, I could bring a smile. And if, if, if a frown come, just forgive me. But for the most part, if I can make you smile, that's the whole point of all of this. And to be able to communicate and get it out. So, yeah, that's what it is. But I have three girls and a son. My oldest daughter lives in Colorado somewhere. I think that's where she's at. She lives somewhere. She grown as ever and married. And two of my grandchildren are with her. And then her, the oldest one is in another city in Toledo with my baby girl and her children. And she has seven girls. And then my other daughter lives in Columbus and she has four children. So yeah. And then I have three other grandchildren that live in Seattle with my husband's, which are my husband's children, which are my children too, they're my babies too, and then my grandbabies. So, and there's three grandbabies there. 
So God is good all the time. And I'm so thankful. I'm so grateful that I'm still here. And I just, like I told you guys, I just wanted to complete um, the video that I did for the weekend. And since I'm sick, I just feel like I showed you the real and see what is happening. You can see what's going on in my world. But I'm just ill right now. Tomorrow, prayerfully, it's a better day and everything goes better than today, right? Because God got us and we all are right. We'll be all right. And um, yeah, it's a total of 17 grandchildren all together. So I'm a grandma of 17, guys. And I have, like I said, four of my children, three of my stepchildren, and so that is a total of seven. Seven children minus one, but he didn't have any children. My son didn't have any kids. I wish he would have, but <laughs> he didn't. So, well, thanks guys for coming to my page. I really appreciate you all. I hope this clears up why I didn't finish all those videos for my Bible, but we will go back to like doing Bible verses and stuff. And um, I'll be vlogging a lot more, doing things and showing y'all my life. And I hope you enjoy. And thanks for subscribing. It really helps when y'all subscribe to my page and to my channel. It helps me out a lot because it helps get <clears throat> my followers up so that I can get more time or whatever. I don't even know how I say that or why I say that like that. I don't see. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's called brain fog or lupus fog or whatever you want to call it or forgetfulness. I sometimes call it sometimers because it's not quite all timers, but it can be sometimers. Because <laughs> sometimes I can remember and sometimes I can't. Well, you guys have a blessed night and love you all. And.